Hello YouTube, it is me, Unicorn Guy, here with the uh, Power Mac G4, and um, I know you've seen the, the video of this already, but I wanted to make another one, because my 10.5 uh, upgrade video, I promised to give this a video all of its own. So, uh, here it is. I already started up, but got the network bridge going. Um, let's restart it to see how fast uh, it starts up. Ten point five runs very nicely on here. Um, even though I had to use uh, Leopard Assist, it's very quick to start up. I I really want to upgrade this machine. Hmm. Right now, I spent most of a Sunday afternoon looking up uh, video card options. I found a nice list of. Uh, graphics card for this Mac. Um, the key thing though is it has to support the Apple Display connection or connector or whatever it's called, ADC port. That's what's got support and I looked up a uh, like the little conversion box I had and that's just just really expensive. I think uh, the cheapest I saw was like 86 bucks for um, for one and I mean, the graphics card itself was probably like 20 bucks in eBay, I want to say. That's like the cheapest one I found. And then I had to shell out like 80 some odd bucks to try and get a conversion box just so I can continue to use this display. Now, I could also buy a uh, display that supports DVI. But the only problem with that is that that's also like another 200 bucks. So yeah, or I could also, uh, I think that my computer over here actually supports uh, DVI, but don't quote me on that though, I'm not sure. And either way, I kind of want to use my, I want to keep my television and my Macintosh, well, my television and my computer separate. So, you know, uh, right now I'm using like a uh, 32 megabyte card in here. Oh, hold on, I didn't mean to go software update. Oh, well, that's good. Let's check for some software while I'm doing this about my Mac thing. I think the video card is what held, um, held it away from 10.5. I'd like to upgrade the, gra the, uh, the processor in here, too, but that's going to wait. So graphics and display. So there we go. We got the GeForce 2 MX. I think that is one of the cards that's listed on there that's compatible. Uh, I guess the titanium model is pretty uh, rare. So yeah, um, I also found you can play games on here, so I might uh, might see about getting a couple games for this Mac. I don't know how well they'll run though. That's the only problem. Uh, but all in all, this Mac is pretty nice. I just kind of wish that. Uh, Graphics card is a little bit better than that way. I can, um, I can go away. I can go work into the uh, processor and the, uh, and how how much RAM it has. Although it's pretty zippy, and it handles YouTube quite well. Firefox. The only thing I wish though is that uh, the speaker is a little bit better, but for a built-in speaker, it's not half bad. So, let's go to YouTube. I've been trying out a couple of other different browsers. Uh, I have Shiara on here. And that seems to run pretty good. So, let's look up... Uh, myself. And... I don't know. Why did Apple just decided to discontinue this. I wish they had like a legacy PC support or something. I don't know. Not just completely phase it out. But then again, if some... Well then, well, Microsoft supported Windows 98 up until like 2006, and that's... And for my money, that's pretty good. I mean, this is a 2002 model, and if this was a PC, it would be running... Windows XP, and I could probably get to 
And I probably could get it to run Windows 7, actually, too. But then again, PC parts are more plentiful to supply and a little bit cheaper and amongst other things. Oh, it appears it didn't load. And plus, they're a little bit more interchangeable than, uh, than Macintosh parts here. See, I wish YouTube didn't, like, absolutely just spam you with, um, how up outdated everything is. I know everything's outdated, but I just kind of want to watch my video without having this orange thing and that orange thing. See, the video is a little bit choppy, but that may be because I'm running, um, I'm also using the internet with my, uh, laptop over here, and I have about, I don't know, 20 some odd uh, tabs open to eBay. So, um, I don't know. My neighbor's Power Mac, though, seems to have uh, bitten the dust. And, uh, hopefully, if, uh, if I can give them this, uh, Dell over here for their, for their Power Mac, I can establish the parts from that. If I can, I'm gonna do a massive upgrade to this. Put in, like, I think they had, like, a gig and a half of RAM over there, so... I'll put the gig and a half in here. Uh, replace all these panels. I'll have to get an Allen, Allen screw, uh, Allen wrench set. Uh, I think they had, like, a TV out card in there. Like, a PCI TV out card. Which, in that case, um, I could display... I could use my television as a second monitor if I really wanted to. But then, but since it's um, RCA, I could use uh, a CRT television too if I also wanted to. Uh, if I if I somehow lose interest in this Mac, I might end up using it as like a little media system. Uh, let's see. I'm not sure what else it has. I wonder what the graphics card is though, because if <laughs> if I can get a 64 meg graphics card, that that would be good, and then I'd. I could kind of put the graphics card on the back burner for a little while until um, until I got enough cash or found my way into getting another or found a cheap one of uh, these really high-end graphics card on eBay, like the GeForce Titanium. The cheapest one is forty-nine ninety-nine. That's for bidding it, bidding on it, and it buy it now is a hundred bucks. So yeah, I don't know what. I don't know what it is with eBay, because used, I used to be able to find, like, some pretty good stuff on eBay for dirt cheap, but now it's all getting, you know, pretty pricey. I'm not sure if people are actually researching what they have now, or what. I think it's just a couple people put stuff really high on eBay, then they go see it, and they say, oh yeah, you know what, I could probably get that much for it too. And they, and then hence eBay's flooded with a whole bunch of items that are, like, really expensive. So yeah, um, not really much more to say about this uh, Power Mac, other than I can I can definitely say I'm really liking this right now. So I I finished the software end of things right now. Uh, plan to go to the hardware end of things. I'm not sure if they had another USB card in there though. I'm not sure to figure out what I can use FireWire for as well. But um. Yeah, it's pretty much the extent of things here, so this is Unicorn Guy signing off, and watch out for uh, further update videos.